2009, the Dufferin Peel Catholic District School Board, located west of Toronto, was awarded the prestigious HP Innovations in Education grant. Ascension of Our Lord Secondary, Holy Cross Elementary, and St. Raphael Elementary, three schools located in the Malton neighborhood of the district, were given new technology that included smart boards, wireless tablet PCs, as well as class sets of HP mini notebook computers. The program was coordinated through a partnership with ISTE. I'd like to start by thanking Hewlett Packard and uh, ISTE for their uh, support of this initiative. Uh, we applied for and won the grant and from that grant uh, we used it as a catalyst to infuse technology into uh, three of our Malton schools. From the school board's perspective, we uh, looked across the entire district of well over 145 schools and we noticed that in the Malton area we had significant demographic issues that we, we had to deal with. Uh, in Ascension, for example, we had significantly lower academic uh, achievement results uh, than any other high school in our school district. The technology has been important to this community in particular because we have a very diverse and needy student body. Um, this community has faced a lot of challenges. The demographics of the community in particular, the statistics bear out that there is a lot of poverty in the community, there's crime in the community, um, and attendance and student achievement has been very poor. There's a huge transition for our group. Um, we are in a school that had very low technology, uh, digital age technology instruments in the classroom. Um, and so it meant for us that, uh, you know, kind of birth by fire, we were introduced to the HP technology. Uh, we had about three months to get uh, through using that uh, with smart boards and with projectors in the classroom. It meant that teachers were really transforming the way that they taught. And it's not an easy process. It takes a long time and it takes a lot of work. But uh, it's, it's a very uh, rewarding process. And that in the end, um, you can really see that the kids are benefiting from it. And, and that is really what matters here. Are the kids benefiting from it and are they learning better? I think that the, uh, the teachers really needed to collaborate. It meant that working in teams was important and we were working with both elementary schools and secondary schools together. It really meant that you had to come together as teams, you had to share uh, ideas, you had to share work. And uh, it really meant that uh, teamwork was essential to get this, this going well. Well, I think the students are a lot more accountable for their learning. They can go grab a mini netbook and um, explore concepts that they either need more understanding on or they want to challenge themselves and learn a little bit about concepts, a little more about them. So I think that they're, you know, learning new skills, teaching each other. So they're also going from being the student to the teacher and I think that's a really great skill for them to have. Well, the mini notebooks have really been an invaluable tool in the science class. Um, the students, uh, the focus now has become more student-centered as opposed to teacher-centered. So the students are now more engaged in their own learning and they are working through, filtering through all the information on the internet, working on assignments that I've created for them and they can work at their own pace with their group members. They have, literally have answers at their fingertips and I am more available for those who need more one-on-one -on -one help. Latasha is a grade 10 student attending Ascension of Our Lord. Until the arrival of the new technology, she was often disengaged from learning and struggled academically. At the beginning, I felt like I was a little bit lazy because I always relied on the teacher. I never had access to do my own thing. Now I'm more independent. I don't have to wait for the teacher. So she can, she has time to explain to others and I have my own time. Like it, it makes me be more independent, I would say. Now she knows she's got the answers at her fingertips and if that, and she still needs help, I'm more free now to deal with those students. 
In the end, you know, there isn't a teacher in the, in the program right now with the project who would give up their HP tablet PC next year. I mean, we just can't imagine not teaching without it. Having these notebooks in the class have, has given them so much confidence. Um, you know, feeling like they are important, that they are, you know, good enough to have this technology has really boosted their self-esteem. And I see a lot of them trying harder in class. I see a lot of them, you know, pushing themselves, challenging themselves and teaching each other where in the past they'd be quiet or if you had to give them an assignment on the computer, they wouldn't get it done because they'd be too ashamed to say that they didn't have a computer at home. So this has been a really big blessing for our community and in our school. And the students are saying as well that, uh, you know, can they borrow the mini note so that they can bring it into their English class, bring it into their other classes, because really they want this technology everywhere. It would be really great uh, if we could have HP mini notes in every classroom. Right now we have to share, and really there's a lineup to get these things. Uh, and the same thing is if we could expand this through the whole school, uh, wow, what a wonderful experience. A laptop for every kid. Um, and an HP tablet PC for every teacher would be unbelievably great.